Hello, and in this video I'm going to be unboxing the uh, signature edition of the Candle, the Power of the Flame uh, video game for Nintendo Switch. So this is the kind of the limited edition uh, version of the game. Um, you can see there, this is uh, made up by Signature Edition. And they make these really nice editions of these uh, little indie games that otherwise kind of wouldn't really get a physical release um, and merge uh, games there. And then the developers, I believe, are Teku Studios, so... Very nice. So this includes soundtrack, art book, enamel pin, and three puppets. So that's going to be interesting. Comes in a box. This is about the size of a Blu-ray case, a PS4 uh, disc case. It's about the size of that. It's a bit thicker, but the front of it is about that size. And you've got all the signatures of the... I, I'm assuming these are the developers on the front here. Very nice artwork on the front of the box, and it's got um, uh, it's still in the plastic wrap. Um, so very nice. Now, because I pre-ordered this, uh, well, actually, firstly, uh, this also came in the package. This signature edition, I guess it's it's kind of the size of a postcard, but it's got this on the other side, so that's nice. Nice card, glossy finish. Um, very nice, so got that. And then because I pre-ordered this, uh, they also sent a uh, a coin which on the back has signature edition games. In fact, let's just open it here. Straight away, let's just open it so you can see. So you can see that there, signature edition here along the bottom. It says Candle there, Teku Studios, and Candle again, and then you've got the kind of the flame in the middle of the coin. On the back, it says Signature Edition. So that's a really nice thing, and it's really heavy for the size. It's not, it's not very big, but it's uh, for the size, it's quite a heavy thing. So that's really nice. I really like that. So I just. Go ahead and leave those things there. Now to actually open the game itself and all the other interesting things. Um, should be enough. Oh yeah, this is the back of the... I'll get the wrapper off first. Didn't really show the box in its entirety, so I apologise for that. i get the wrapper off, though. Out of the way. So there's the front of the box. Uh, there's the bio, kind of. Uh, the information about the story in the game. Uh, you've got some images of the gameplay there, and then all the other necessary information. There's the bottom, the side, the other side, and then the top. So let's open this up. Being quite careful. This looks interesting. So first things first, we have just pop that there. We have the game itself. I'm assuming this is the same uh, version that you can get physically. Uh, I don't think there's any difference to the back. 
or anything. Um, but yeah, there's the game. We'll open that up in a second. There is some nice foam inside of here to keep everything nice in its place. So what's this? Oh, this is one of the puppets. And that tells you how that all fits together and that's interesting. I guess you cut that out. I do include oh, okay. Ah, okay, so this this explains to you how to Okay, so it tells you what you need. These aren't included, but they are needed to create these puppets. Uh, there, and it says, due to health and safety concerns, we are unable to supply the necessary fasteners needed to make the candle puppets. Well, that's interesting. And I'll say, I'll talk about why that's interesting that they couldn't include those in a second, but. Um, so we'll put those puppets. There, I think to me that I mean they're nice, but I wish they'd have just been like postcards with the characters on. From my perspective, I just wish they'd have been postcards with the characters on them, so you could put them up like a little tiny poster. But yeah, I'll talk about those in a minute, a bit more. So the next thing we have is a pin badge or enamel pin, as they call it very nice. I don't know who this character is because I haven't played the game yet, but that's very nice. Comes in a little plastic plastic uh, bag, a bit like the, very, well in fact very similar to the what packaging the coin came in. So there is that, very nice. We'll go ahead and put that with the coin. Okay, so what else? Uh, we have... Ooh, what's this? Oh, this is the soundtrack. Oh, wow, there's a lot here. Okay, bonus tracks. Original soundtrack. Yeah, there's quite... There's like a full soundtrack here from the game. I'm not even going to try and pronounce those names, so <laughs> I apologise, but yeah, I don't want to butcher those. Um, nice cover. Oh yeah, look at that. That is very nice. Much. This is much nicer than just having a, a piece of cardboard that you slide the disc into. This is a much nicer, much nicer look. So there is the original soundtrack for Candle, The Power of the Flame. So you get this. Head and pop. Just move some of this stuff. This. Bring that in a bit closer. And then I believe the final thing, which I've just taken out, and then there's this. This is nice foam to keep everything nice and in place to so stop things moving about too much inside the box. So we'll go ahead and close that box back up. There's the box. And then the last thing is this art book. Now this art book is pretty thick. Um, it's it's got a lot of it's got a lot of pages in it. Uh, Wow, yeah, look at that. That is lovely. Oh, yeah, it's got some information about the game. And, oh, that's really nice. I'm not going to go through each page because um, uh, it's a really lengthy book. It's got, does it number the pages? It doesn't actually number the pages, I don't think. But there's a lot of pages. I'll tell you that. There's a lot of pages of good art goodness in this book so I'll just give you a flick flick through it there so that's really really nice really love art books for games and things like that so that's really cool love that so that's what you get uh, in the signature edition copy uh, of candle the power of the flame so I guess the only thing left to do now I was just about to end the video but I guess the only thing to do now is uh, actually open open up the game itself I apologise if I don't sound quite like my usual self. I've not been very well recently, so I do apologise. But there's the back. There's the back of the game case, and it tells you about the game and stuff. Again, pictures. That's a nice picture there. It tells you the play modes and things. Cool stuff. You open it up. Yep. Yeah. 
Oh, that's really nice. I like that. Kind of the sketch on the end side. Um, very nice. I was just expecting this to be blank, but actually we've got some out on the inside as well, so that's really nice. There's the game cartridge. Take that out. That is what that looks like. And then there's the back of the game cartridge for those people that like to see the back of the game card. So there you go. Very nice. So yeah, um, really nice. Uh, addition. This addition is really cool. Uh, I really like it. Um, you get everything that's here when you order this, um, except if you didn't pre-order it, they don't include the, the coin. But everything else, um, yeah, it's a really nice addition. I think it's about £40 for this uh, uh, this edition here. So yeah, I, I think it's worth it. I think it's pretty cool. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, I hope it's been useful to you. I hope you've enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next video. Subscribe if you like this video. Thumbs up, thumbs down, all that stuff. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now. Sorry, what I did forget to mention is that uh, I did mention earlier in the video about these and the fact that they couldn't include them. Uh, why I was a bit perplexed by that, and I did forget to mention this in the official, you know, in the original video, is that they include this pin, uh, and the pin kind of has a small little thing here, the cover, and also a sharp uh, object there. So I don't really understand why they couldn't include those. Um, it doesn't really make much sense as to why they couldn't include them, but um, they didn't include them uh, anyway for the puppets. So yeah, I just thought I, I just thought I'd mention that because I did forget to mention that in the in the original video. Okay, thanks for watching.